Hey everybody, SlayerXDR here with GamerFusion.com, Empowering You Gaming, and we are back with some more Dracula 5 The Blood Legacy. Let's... This must be the Vlad Tepes book Jerry was talking about. I'll take a look at it later. Okay, so now we're looking for some oil and some solvent. Um, let's go over here. Tip to permanently display the interactive areas of the sur surroundings. Enable... I didn't get a chance to look at that. There's a recorder in the video surveillance cabinet. It keeps a record of everyone coming into and leaving the reserve collection. Okay, can I go in there? or I need to go somewhere else. I need to go where the... Ah, oh, there's the stuff. Hostess. Uh, let's see, what do we have here? H104. Oil. Oh, you need oil. Oil vial. Okay, well, let's S257. There. Let me click. Okay, we need to. Okay. Isn't it S257? Hmm, I can't get to it. Got the oil, but I can't get the solvent. Oh no, it's this one. That's right. Okay, there's an S two thirty seven. Ha <laughs> ha! Got him. Now we'll go back over here. I have a feeling we need to go ahead and use this. Oh, we need to mix it with this. Yep. I was compressed soak with solution. There he is. So this is what Dracula looked like. Or Vlad Tepes, rather. The painting looks alive. I've never seen anything like it. The painting's getting darker. How strange. How strange? I don't think the it is. The painting's getting darker. How strange. That's not necessary anymore. Wasn't it unnecessary? What does that do? I wonder. Clickoprec? What are the drugs for? Oh, you can kill yourself. Um. Um. Take them several ways together, but be smart. You shouldn't be reckless with your health. I don't say it. that's kind of cool. You take drugs. Let's go ahead and talk to I'm starting to, him. to understand why Vanbury was fascinated with this portrait. He looks alive, like he's watching us. You're right. It's gripping. Apart from perhaps Mona Lisa's smile, I've rarely seen such a disturbing expression on a painting. It looks like the varnish is darkening. Right, I noticed that too. Do you think I shouldn't have removed the tar layer? No. That can happen when the finishing layer hasn't been exposed to light for a while. I don't think that the painting will darken too much. The shadow of the dragon. What did you say? N nothing special. Vlad Tepes was called Dracula and the dragon. So I was thinking that if this is really a portrait of him, well, we've literally seen the shadow of the dragon. That's funny. One of the books I was reading had an excerpt of a poem of the same name. Vlad's younger brother wrote it. Really? Can I look at it? Of course. It's on my desk. I'll leave it there for you. But maybe you should put the painting in the storage room. You shouldn't do too much with it on the first day. Right. I'll do that. As for me, I'm going home. And I really want to congratulate you. If all of Kanayek's paintings are this good, you might have discovered a new Da Vinci. This hmm. must be the Vlad Tepes book Jerry was talking about. I'll take a look at it later. Okay, so we need to get the painting and take it to storage. Uh, 
I don't feel good. I didn't take my medicine because I forget to with the jet lag. Uh oh. Read the directions. Okay. Well, I can't do anything when you don't let me. I need to take it back. Storage. I don't feel good. I Well, that was interesting. The game actually crashed on me too, which kind of sucked, but... I'll have to use my card to enter. Let's go ahead and get sucked the card. The reserve is the perfect place for storing the painting overnight. Hmm. I'd better cover the painting. Too much light could accelerate the darkening process. Gotta go ahead and cover this up. Anything else I can take in here that I might need? Nope. I should take the call. Metropolitan Museum of Art, Restoration Workshop, Ellen Cross speaking. Ellen, it's Adam. You're finally back. Y yes. Uh, hello, Adam. I heard you were in New York. Is that right? Just for a few days. I was afraid I wouldn't catch you. If you're free for dinner this evening, maybe you could tell me about your trip to Turkey. Well, yes. Uh, I do have a few things to do, but uh, sure, why not? I can pick you up at the museum. In an hour? Sure. Hmm, interesting. We're going on a date. Man, I can't do nothing else with that, so... Um... The director isn't there. I think we can go ahead and leave now, but... Maybe. This is no time to go home. Well, he's getting ready to pick you up, right? Okay, so he's not there, so... I'll have to use my card to enter. Uh-huh, I noticed. I know, you had to rub it to me. Maybe we can go ahead and read that book. Let's go ahead and see if we can read that. Yeah, there we go. Vlad Basarab III, known as Tepes, the Impaler, was the inspiration for Bram Stoker's Dracula character. But few people know his real story. Tepes was the son of Vlad II, known as Dracul, the dragon. Tepes was the heir to the Valachian throne. He spent his childhood in Turkey, where Sultan Murad II held both him and his younger brother Radu hostage. It is said that Radu was the Sultan's favorite. Vlad was released in 1448, 14 years before his younger brother. This is probably why Radu the Handsome deeply resented his older brother throughout his whole life. People even say that Radu drove Vlad's beloved wife to suicide. Radu made her think that her husband had died. He gave her the dagger with which she killed herself. The prince never recovered from this tragedy. As legend has it, that was when he plunged into the netherworld. This book has a copy of a letter from Radu the letter shows the rivalry that pitted these two men against each other. 
Radu also wrote a poem called The Shadow of the Dragon. It seems that this poem was meant for his brother. I love the enriching story. Oh, here we go. So happy to see you, Ellen. Me too. <laughs> so you ended up finding the portrait? Tell me about it. How did you do that? It's a long story, and it was in terrible condition. Professor Vanbury had covered it with tar. I'm still cleaning it up, but I'm making headway. I'm sure that you'll be able to restore it to its original glory. I hope so, but it looks fragile. The glaze has become slightly darker ever since it's been exposed to the open air. Do you think the process can be reversed? I think so, but it'll take some time. Well, if you can keep it a secret, I can show it to you. Oh yes, I'd love to. I didn't dare ask. <clears throat> Across my heart, I'll be as silent as the grave. Good. Let's go then. Oh god. Naughty, naughty girl. Attention, please. Adam, please meet Dracula. Ellen, are you all right? Are you all right? Do you feel better? Um, yes. What happened? You fainted at the museum. Don't you remember? I wanted to call the paramedics, but you said it should be fine. You just wanted to go back home. So I called a taxi, and here we are. Are you sure you don't want me to call for a doctor? Something's wrong. No, don't worry. I don't need a doctor. You did the right thing. I actually need a drink. I think I have a bottle of wine. Ellen, I'm not sure it's a good idea. Just look at you. You can hardly stand up. <sighs> I'm tired of being reasonable, Adam. What? Adam? Are you there? That couldn't have been a dream. That's really weird. That was extremely weird, actually. Well, it's not much, but it could keep me from losing consciousness again. Alright, good deal. Some more pills. Let's take a gander around here in this lovely, lovely apartment. It's not the right time. It's not the right time? What do you mean? It's not the right time for what? Let's go over here. What do we got? I would have liked to have news from Adam before going to work. He could be taking a shower. Where is your showers at? Um, anything going on over here? No. Aha! Ellen. I couldn't bring myself to wake you up. I'm going back to London this morning, but I'll call you very soon. Take care of yourself. Lots of love, Adam. So it wasn't a dream. No. Oh. No, I didn't mean to click that. I didn't realize that's how it ended that. That sucked. It was gonna go back and read that. Look at surprising, there's so much stuff in here. Uh, my first night in New York was eventful after showing Adam the portrait I suddenly fainted. When I woke up, he had already taken me back home. I don't know if it was my intimate death that cast off my shyness, but in any case, I couldn't resist kissing him, and it was obvious that he enjoyed it. But he's disappeared this morning, but the note he's left on the table suggests that we'll see each other soon. Well, if my health cooperates. My health condition is becoming worse by the day. I'm afraid that I won't be able to hide my illness for much longer. Get to show Adam the portrait. Oh, it's even got dialogue. That's so cool. So let's go ahead and get our health back up. No, 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 no. Go back to the game. There right, we go. Okay. They want that to be real that short. There's the lovely catch that we was on. Anything down here? That kind of... Oh, was that a bill? There's some Chinese tape. What is that doing in the floor like that? That should be thrown away. 
Ah, nasty. Come on now. I guess that's how you do it in New York. I don't know. Ah, come on. It's not the right time. It's not the right time. Okay, whatever. Can we go behind the kitchen? Can we do anything over there? No. Guess that's all we can really do. Alright, I guess we're leaving the, the house. The apartment. Did I just warp here? Nice. Very nice. Alright, let's go ahead and see if the director is back. The director isn't there. Why isn't he not there? Okay, let's equip our key cord. Jerry's not going to be there either. He said he left. I can't believe it. The painting's gone. There hasn't been a break in. There must be an explanation. This video camera automatically turns on whenever anyone comes into the storage room. I'll have to look at the video to understand what could have happened. Hmm. Let's go in here. Let's check this camera. Uh-oh. I guess you don't know the password. Hmm. We're going to have to find it, too, I guess. Let's look around, because I know we don't know what the password is. There's no way. Jerry must have forgotten his mailbox key. Jerry must have forgotten his mailbox key. Uh, okay, so he forgot his key, but we need the way in. Come on, there's got to be something here. Let's go over here and check. Wait, what is this? Mm, that can't be it. That looks like something that could have been it. Let's go ahead and check in here. Mailboxes. I'm not expecting any mail. <sighs> Come on now. The director isn't there. Okay, let's try this. Maybe we've got something in these notes that will tell us. Okay. Yeah, but we need information. We need to know how to get in the thing. Alright, well. I really regret not going to the trouble of learning this code by heart. Does anybody know it then? There has to be. I bet you he has the code in his mailbox. Jerry must have forgotten his mailbox key. Oh, well, that ain't gonna help us. Can we maybe call them? I wonder if she'll call. Before telling anyone, I should look at the video of the surveillance camera. Well, how are you going to do that if you don't know the password? Huh. There's got to be something obvious. There it? We'll try just different combinations. That's all I know to do, just until I can figure out. Let's try zero two one. I'm looking at some of the numbers on that one thing. Zero. Nope. She should say something about this is what we need to do. This is what we need to. So she won't go over here. She won't look at his computer. She just says he forgot his mailbox key. Um. Hmm. We are in a real pickle here. But that's how these puzzle games are, though. You have to look around at everything. Every nook and cranny. Every little detail that cannot go unmissed. You cannot look around. Let's try... Can't get his key, so we can't... Let's take a look back around in here. Um, anything in here? No. Hmm, that sucks. Okay. 
Can we go over here? No. No. Jacket, no. I'm not expecting any mail. The director isn't there. The director's not there, so... Um... This is no time to go home. Yeah, it is. It is plenty of time to go home. Eesh. That wasn't exactly what I needed. Huh? I'm not expecting any mail. I'll have to use my card to enter. Hmm. I don't see anything to help us here. This could be bad. You would think the code would be somewhere where I would... One... Hmm. Where are you, code? Can't believe it's shit. Where is it? Hmm. I like. I don't know what this is right here. That could be possible code, but it won't let me look at it further, closer. Hmm. Let's see. Zero one zero two three. Let's try zero one zero, and then I'll, if that don't work, I'll try three two four. I think it might be, but let's try three two one. Zero one, no nope, zero one four. One eight eight five six six five two. Hmm. That sucks. She needs to remember this crap by heart. Damn it. Five. Wait a minute. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Maybe this no. The that has nothing to do with it. Well crap. Wait a second. Two five I'm gonna try I'm just gonna try one of these bottles. Two five Three, two, seven. Ah. Uh, hmm. Number five, five, five. Let's try this. That. Nope. No cigar. Ah. Uh, yes. Well, that's all the time I have for this part. Unfortunately, or I'm going to run out of time. If you guys like this part, I'm going to try to figure out where to go from here. But I hope that you guys enjoyed this part so far of Dracula 5 The Blood Legacy I'm enjoying it I'm enjoying the story so far the puzzle like just trying to find this code is kind of ridiculous because I don't know where to look but I will figure it out and then when I do I will we will go on and further into the mysteries of Dracula and I hope you and if you did enjoy it make sure to hit that like button if you have any questions or concerns let me know inbox me or you can deal with the shitty Google's plus comments. I, oh, oh, I just, uh, uh, also, if you're new to the channel and you like my videos, make sure to subscribe. It's free. You don't have to pay anything for it. And it's always a great feeling to subscribe to a good channel, to a good channel and you get to watch every day. Also, make sure to share with your friends, family, anybody on Twitter, Facebook, anybody that you know to get my channel out there. I would really appreciate it. And as always, guys, it's SlayerXTR with GamerFusion.com, empowering your gaming. And until next time, it's Slayer signing out. <laughs>